isn't getting legalized at the federal level, but it is set to become a lot less illegal. Basically, the DEA is going to reclassify marijuana from a Scheduled 1 drug to a Scheduled 3 drug. For context, a Scheduled 1 drug is one that's considered to have no accepted medical use and a high potential for abuse, such as heroin and cocaine, whereas Scheduled 3 includes drugs like steroids and Tylenol with codeine. Admittedly, this change will mostly affect research and weed companies' taxes, but it's a start. In other news, the Supreme Court is not messing with Texas. The court just denied a request to block a Texas law that will require age verification to access porn sites. The challengers, which included the ACLU and a trade group for adult performers, argued that this law will create privacy issues and risk exposing users to tracking and extortion. But it seems people who want adult content in the Lone Star State will have to keep handing over their personally identifying info. And this is a little concerning. Even though the USDA is confident America's meat supply is safe, they now plan on testing samples of ground beef for bird flu. The reason is that there have been confirmed outbreaks of bird flu in dairy cows across the country. Now, the good news, the Department of Agriculture has confirmed that all the ground beef samples collected so far have tested negative for the bird flu virus.